Yo, what's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Tay TV. In my reaction video, I'll be reacting to Sonic Frontiers Combat and Upgrades. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Let's get into this video again, guys. Please, please subscribe to my channel. It will, it will mean, it means a lot. Thank you. Sonic Frontiers is going to be a good game. Sonic Frontiers introduces a new I'm gonna see if it's gonna be better than Sonic Unleashed. By combining blistering speed with blazing combat. Skill time, tree and Sonic upgrade. has a skill tree full of exciting and powerful new abilities to learn. To unlock new skills, you'll need to collect enough skill pieces from fallen enemies and breakable items around the islands. Okay. Sonic also has a standard move set, including a homing attack, Woo! drop dash and stomp at the beginning of the game. While these moves are effective against normal enemies, you'll need to level up and unlock new skills if you want to take on bigger and stronger foes awaiting you on the Starfall Islands. A normal enemy on Kronos Island is nothing compared to those on later islands. So make sure you're collecting the red seeds of power and blue seeds of defense to boost your stats and give yourself a fighting chance. Combos and abilities. As the game progresses and Sonic levels up, so do your enemies. Completing combos is a good way to get the upper okay. hand during battle, especially when paired with a new skill called Phantom Rush. Phantom Rush? Sonic's combo meter will fill up after attacking enemies consecutively. Once the combo meter is maxed out, Phantom Rush is activated, and your attack power will be boosted until the meter reaches zero. Okay, attack power gonna be like that. <laughs> that was a good combo burst, right there. Sonic Boom. A long-range, high-speed kick that unleashes shockwaves at the enemy. Another option to dish out major hurt on your enemies is Wild Rush. A flashy, zigzagging attack that sends you crashing into your targets with great force. It's a fast and stylish way to hit your enemies hard while avoiding incoming fire. Certain enemies in Sonic Frontiers have a shield or barrier protecting them. Break their shield with Silu, and then deal as much damage as you can before it goes back up. If your opponent happens to land a hit on you, just use the Silu ability on the ground to collect more rings and get back in the fight. During combat, you'll need to study your opponents and determine the best strategy to take them on. Encounters with Guardians will require more than just using your homing attack. Many of them prompt you to engage with their unique <laughs> combat mechanics first before reaching their weak spot. Once you have an opening, you can dish out all the skills you okay, unlock Sonic, the skill tree. Sonic attacked that Experimenting opening. Experimenting with new abilities and discovering each enemy's weakness will help you defeat them with ease. Use your enemy's moves against them by utilizing parry during combat. A visual cue lets you know when an enemy is about to attack. If you okay. react quickly enough, you can parry it and follow it up with a counterattack of your own. Using all these skills and more gives you tons of options to become the most formidable force in the frontier. Master your approach to battle and teach your enemies not to mess with Sonic the Hedgehog. This is it for this reaction video. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Whatever videos you guys would like me to react to leave in the comment section i will react to it please subscribe thank you